thought that uh, for a large part, portion of the game, we we uh, executed our game plan as well as we could have. Uh, I think we ran out of some gas. We, uh, we've we got some injuries. And so we don't have the depth that we w would normally have. And then uh, we're trying to keep 20 out of uh, foul trouble. So um, we didn't have her for large portions of the game at, at the beginning. But we turned it around, fought back, and, and uh, did a great job, I thought. It's definitely hard because, you know, the other team, they're making adjustments, so we have to make adjustments too, and we did. So we just had to – well, we just had to watch film and just really dissect what we did last game and try to do better this game, and I think we did that. So. Well, you know uh, – Tia Montaigne is our, she's our best defender. And we, you, we, we trying to put the heat on people. And, and uh, Germany Matt broke her hand at Northeastern. She had surgery. Those are two starters. So I can't say enough about, about the individuals who have come behind them. And, and I'm going to say next woman stand up, even though it, it, it's, it's, you know, next man step up. But, you know, people have stepped in and, and uh, you know, I even played uh, – Amaya Reed's at the four today, you know. So, um, you know, they've been willing to do whatever it is that, that we asked them, and, and we, we're certainly proud of that. Did, um, and in the last, last week's game, you guys came back from a big lead, and it was almost the opposite here. Did, what was going through your mind, like, in the third quarter break, when you had your head to 12 point lead, and it was almost like they were down one point? Mm -hmm. um, definitely, we. I feel like we we kept our composure um, because most of the time it's hard to once you see that you have that big lead and they come back like that and it's hard to you know keep going keep going but we had my teammates we were encouraging each other the whole time to just stay in the game stay in the game keep our heads and we did that and yeah. That's me. And, we can't tell nobody. That's me and not a secret. <laughs> <laughs> that was Maya. Yeah, it was Maya. Maya Reese. Uh, had you seen something? On yeah. Home? No, I I, I I see it during the game, okay. and then I I say it to her and 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 the inbound. It's a secret. Can't tell you what it is. It's a secret. I can tell you, but that I can't let you go back to him. <laughs> You know, uh, and I think Nala would say this too, we just say we got to continue to put pressure on them. You know, it might not work at, at the beginning, but eventually it'll wear them down. And, and so that's kind of what we keep saying. Hey, you're not putting enough pressure on them. You're not putting enough pressure on them. Keep putting pressure on them. Two big things, it seems like you guys did real well on the Oh, of course. That's that's the one thing. That's the two things we hold at the top is to control the boards and to uh, force turnover. So those are two big things that we focus on every game. Coach, you guys held them with, with I think it was a one-point game midway through the fourth quarter. I don't think Delaware had a field goal for the last six minutes. Was there anything differently defensively, or do you think the pressure just finally wore them down? Yeah, I, I, you know, going having to go – against that pressure all the time, all the time. Just relax. And the more people you have, the more you can press. And and and, and so we were able to get uh, Nala back in there and and, uh, and take some of their uh, guards away. Uh, and we just had to remember not to lose 30. And we did that a couple of times. But it certainly was a great game for us. Well, you guys just talk a little bit about tomorrow. You have to get the number one seed. 
Oh, we don't get a day off? <laughs> nah, we uh, we know the Towson is a, a great athletic ball club, and you know we'll have our hands full. But once again, you know we'll have to be try to turn them over. That, that, that's all we can do, turn them over, because you, you know we're not a big team, so uh, the rebounds don't come in bunches for us. So turnovers got have to be our rebounds. Uh, Tia Montaigne, uh, and then um, you know Lauren Van Arsdale just came back, yeah, yeah, all right, and and uh, Germany Map is a starter. She's had a uh, surgery on her hand. What day was that? Uh, like like Friday? No, Saturday. Last Saturday. Last Saturday. Last Saturday. Very good. Thank you. Congratulations. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, we just we weren't good enough today, and uh, we had 26 turnovers. I mean, that's the story of the last game we played, and we had 30 turnovers, um, and that's that's been our Achilles heel. You know, we uh, we struggled this year at the guard position, just being able to handle pressure, and it um it caught up to us. It's caught up to us, you know. So you guys are up one midway or pretty much midway through the fourth quarter, and I don't think had a field goal in like the last six minutes. Was it something that they did or? Just not, had. not we had some wide open looks. I think we shot 13 percent in the fourth quarter, and uh, you know we had some wide open looks. There were possessions where we weren't as organized as we needed to be, um, you know. But it boils down to we got to make laps and we got to make shots, and uh, you know that's how you win games at this level. You got to find players that are capable of putting the ball in the basket on a regular basis, and uh, in the fourth quarter we didn't do that. There were a lot of runs in the game. I think you were down 12 points or so late in the third quarter. You had a big run to get back even and then kind of back and forth all day. When, when things were going well for you guys, what, what was it that was? You know, we're a really good team when we're able to run and, and get up and down, and those are the moments where we're at our best. And, um, you know, when teams are able to slow us down from that, you know, we struggle in the half court when teams are able to slow us down and keep us from running. And in the third quarter, he didn't have, he only had one time out and uh, he wasn't able to, you know, get his group, his kids regrouped. And so we were able to get up and down a little bit. That helped us have that big court, third quarter run. Um, but in the fourth, we just, we didn't make any shots and we didn't, we didn't capitalize on the opportunities that we had. What about their, Coach Six talked about it, what, what about their pressure so hard to deal with? Because they do that to everybody's not. Yeah, you know, we we played them last week, and, you know, we were up 15 going into the fourth quarter, and they pressed us the whole game. You know, I just think that, you know, it, it boils down to, um, you know, a confidence level and as a player being confident that you can handle the ball during pressure and not, you know, um, folding in those moments. And I think sometimes we get a little bit flustered um, and our decision-making isn't the best. And then maybe just comment, Joel Smalls had a nice game for you, 16 and 10, hit some big three-point shots uh, below 10. Just maybe talk a little bit about it. Yeah, I'm proud of that kid. You know, all year she's fought and she's competed and, uh, you know, she wants to win and she tries her best to get, to put her best foot forward every day. And she's a competitor. And, you know, it's been an honor to, to be able to coach her. And she's she's been one of the people on our team who's kind of kept the engine running. You know, and if you if you would have told me when we started this year, I would, we would have 16 wins with this group, I would tell you you were crazy. You know, we, we lost it. We're the only team in the league that didn't bring a starter back, and we've got a whole new team. And you know, the kids that we have brought back, they don't, they didn't play. You know, they played six, seven minutes a game on their previous teams. And you know, so if you would have told me I would take this group and they would fight to win 16 games, I'd tell you out of your mind. So very proud of how hard they competed this year and how hard we played, and we just got to regroup and, and get better and come back next year a lot stronger. Right, thank Thanks, guys. Yeah.